Understanding the phrase, wiring. Hello, dear learners. Today, we're diving deep into the phrase, wiring. This word might sound technical, and that's because it often is. But like many words in English, it can have multiple meanings based on context. Let's break it down together. The most common and straightforward meaning of wiring relates to electrical circuits. Wiring refers to the network of conductors and other devices that form a circuit. In simple terms, it's the system of wires used to connect electrical equipment. Imagine the cables behind your TV or computer. That's the wiring, ensuring electricity flows and your devices function. The beauty of the English language lies in its ability to borrow literal terms and give them a figurative spin. Wiring is no exception. When we say, it's just how he's wired, or she's wired that way, we aren't talking about actual wires. Instead, it's a metaphorical way to describe someone's nature, temperament, or inclinations. In this sense, wiring alludes to the internal makeup of a person. Like how a machine's wiring determines its function, a person's wiring, their experiences, genetics, upbringing, etc., influences their behavior and character. Let's look at some common phrases involving wiring. 1. Crossed wires. This means there's been a misunderstanding or miscommunication between people. 2. Hot wiring. A method used to start a vehicle without a key, often associated with theft. 3. Hardwired. Ingrained, inherent, or deeply embedded in someone's nature. And there you have it. Wiring is more than just electrical circuits. It's also a window into understanding behaviors, personalities, and even occasional mix-ups. We hope this breakdown has illuminated the different shades of wiring for you. Until next time, keep learning and exploring the nuances of the English language.